OEMs are constantly striving to meet strict emission regulations that apply to their vehicles. One innovative way, currently employed by manufacturers, is using an electronically controlled thermostat for gasoline engines. G'day, I'm Zach. Welcome to Automate. First, what is an electronically controlled thermostat? It's part of a system that relies on sensor inputs to the ECM or cooling module to manage and control heat transfer. There are numerous control maps programmed into the module, using different set points for the various driving conditions needed to activate the thermostat. So let's reflect on a conventional thermostat. They've served us pretty well up till now, but there are some limitations. Conventional types only have one opening temperature and generally start to open a few degrees before it. Because of this, the cooler radiator fluid begins to mix with a hot engine coolant too early, removing the heat energy needed for the engine components to reach optimal operating temperatures. As a result, this incurs longer warm-up times, increased emissions and fuel consumption. An electronically controlled thermostat can be opened or closed independent of coolant temperature via an internal heating element and return spring. This means the ECM can adjust the amount of coolant flow by controlling the heater within the thermostat. One of the main benefits of this technology is the reduction in hydrocarbons and carbon monoxide gases produced during part throttle applications. The ECM is programmed to maintain hotter operating temperatures under these conditions, allowing for a complete combustion event, which reduces fuel consumption. To watch the full video or any of our automotive training modules, just visit our website to find out how you can become an Automate member today.